Welcome back. This time at City Pork Brasserie and Bar, we're going to learn about their most important tool in the kitchen, the smoker. Being a meats and charcuterie restaurant, City Pork Brasserie and Bar uses smoked meats on about half of their menu. This is a big tool in our kitchen here. This is the baby. Our, yes, it is. Talk about what's in the smoker. Well, we have uh, smoked uh, pork butts that we've been doing for 12 hours now. They, we let them go overnight. So by the time we get here in the morning, they're pretty much ready to pull off the bone. Wow. And how is that going to last the whole day for service, or how long does it last? Yeah, I mean, pretty much one day, maybe one and a half days of service per, per time we smoke. And what other meats do you guys have? We have uh, briskets, and we also do uh, chicken for our club sandwiches. All right, awesome. Can we open the smoker? <laughs> dun, dun. Beware. <laughs> wow. Oh, that looks delicious. Yeah, so they got a nice crust on the outside of them, nice color to them. Amazing. And would you put anything on these meats before you put them in? Yeah, we have a uh, special rub that we do. We mix our Creole seasoning and a little bit of uh, brown sugar. So. All right, so what are you going to show us how to make? We're actually going to do our signature sandwich, the big pig. The bone pulls right out of there. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this pork butt. Uh-huh. Go ahead and close that for me. We're actually going to shred Look at the how it falls apart. I didn't get you any gloves so you can play with it. I know. What's up with I that? I know. You get all nasty with this whole <laughs> smoked meat. That is amazing. It really just falls apart. This is how many hours? This is 12 hours. 12 hours. 12 hours at 250 degrees. Wow. And we use apple wood in our smoker, so it's a nice, uh, sweet flavored wood. Mmm, broken apart. Once we do this, we're just gonna we're gonna put it on the bun. We're gonna douse it down with our house-made barbecue sauce. Mm -hmm. Put in a, a fresh coleslaw on top of it. Now, is this your uh, specialty recipe for the barbecue sauce? This was actually one of the owner's recipes, so oh. I can't tell you about that. And do you love it? No, it's great. It's, great. it's great. It's very sweet, very uh, spicy. Has uh -huh. just a little bit of sriracha in it too, so it kind of gives it that kick. Yeah. You give them about eight ounces of the meat. You are gonna try this, huh? Uh, yeah. What bread are you using? We're using a uh, a buttery bun. Look at that hot sauce. We make a nice mayo-based coleslaw to kind of act. Uh, oh. You give have you a to have a nice mayo-based coleslaw to put on top of a pulled pork And that's why sandwich. we call it the big pig right there. Look at that. Look at it next to my head. It's huge. I gotta say, oh. your head's still a little bigger. Though. My head's just a little bigger. <laughs> just a little. All right, let's cut into this. I'm so excited. And you serve this with some we, homemade uh, chips? Homemade chips and a nice house-made spicy pickle. That's pickle. Oh, this looks amazing. And then... Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, wow. Time of the day and be happy. Right? This is perfect. The buttery bun, the whole sauce, the meat is, of course, fantastic. You can really taste the smokiness. And that barbecue sauce is really different. It is. You know, it's sweet, but you still get that kick and you totally taste the sriracha. You gotta come and try this sandwich. Wow. This is one of the best pulled pork sandwiches I've ever had. Loved it so much, I just mm. couldn't. Stop <laughs> eating <napkin>. it. <laughs> it's incredible. Delicious. Really um, tender. Great sauce with it. It's really good. I'd definitely come back. This sandwich is on point. So delicious. Obviously, City Fork knows what they're doing when it comes to smoking meats. Come by, check them out. The sandwich would be great with a beer or maybe a specialty cocktail. We're going to find out all about their drink menu next time on Carla's Kitchen. More on City Fork.